Baraka the Yahweh, Baraka the Yahweh Shai. That means blessed be the Most High Yahweh, and that means blessed be the Most High, the, the Most High Son Yahweh Shai. Baraka the Yahweh, Baraka the Yahweh Shai. Call Allah and Allah Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai by Shem Yahweh Kakodash. I want to give double honors to the apostles of Great Millstone who rule and teach you all. And I want to say shalom to all you brothers and sisters out there pushing this truth in all honesty and sincerity. I just want to talk about not being afraid, all right? <clears throat> because we're coming into some, um, we're going to be coming to some dreadful times, shake up trouble, all right? Um, persecution is going to get harder, all right? And uh, we need to understand that the Lord is going to be with us as he was with um. <clears throat> David, when he was fleeing from uh, his son Absalom, Absalom, okay. All right, so this is the book of Psalms, chapter um, three. Let me see. All right, I'm gonna start at I'm gonna start at three. Uh, but thou, O Yahweh Shemal Shire, art a shield for me, my glory, the lifter up of mine head. All right. The Lord is a shield for us, man, his men, all right, that's teaching on the highways and byways, that's keeping the laws, that's having faith, that's trusting in them, that's trusting in him, all right. Um, Verse four, I cried unto thee with my voice, and he heard me out of his holy hill. All right, the scriptures command that we call upon the name of the Lord, all right. So if you cry upon the Lord and you call upon his name, all right, he's going to hear you, he's going to save you, all right. Um, I laid me down and slept. I wakened up for the Lord sustained me. All right. So the Lord woke you up. All right. He woke you up today to do the things that he needs you to do. That's pleasing unto him. And he also woke you up to this truth. All right. So that's that's two things the Lord woke you up to. He woke you up to do what you need to do physically on this earth. And then he woke you up to the truth. Okay. All right. So call Allah. All right. This is the point right here. Verse six. I will not be afraid of 10,000 of people that have set themselves against me round about. And who's going to set themselves against the men of the Lord? All right. Um, the government. All right. Two thirds uh, and the heathen. All right. However it may be. All right. Because you out there preaching the word of the Lord. You teaching the truth. All right. According to the Bible. All right. Which is which is never going to fail. OK. Prophecy is never going to fail. And it's going to come about when the Lord wants it to come about. All right. <clears throat> um, and I'm gonna skip. I'm gonna I'm gonna keep going, and then I'm gonna, I'm gonna hit what I need to hit out of verse six because we don't need to be afraid. Arise, O Yahweh, by Shimei Alshai, save me. All right. And if He woke you up, He saved you from death. And if He gave you this truth spiritually, waking you up, He saved you. All right. Now, now it's time for us to turn on the mode of doing for the Lord. All right. Keeping the laws to the best of your ability. Um, having brotherly love. Okay. Um, fast and praying, teaching the word, all right? Um, o power, the most high, for thou hast smitten all my enemies. And that's what he's going to do, smite all the enemies uh, that go against those men that's teaching, preaching and believing and trusting in him upon the cheekbone that thou that thou, ha thou has broken the teeth of the ungodly. Hey, and that's, that's you two-thirds, that's you heathen, especially so-called white men, Esau, Edom. All right, verse 8, salvation belongeth unto Yahweh by Shema All right, salvation, deliverance comes from the Lord, all right? And he gives it to whom he's going to give it to, who's already predestined to receive it. Thy blessing is upon thy people, and who's Lord's people? You so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native American Indians, okay? All right, but uh, this is verse 6. I will not be afraid of 10,000 of people that have set themselves against me round about. All right, so, you know, um... <clears throat> There's going to be enemies of the truth out there, all right, starting with the, um, you know, the federal government, all right, and um, the elite, the world leaders, okay, they not they, they don't like this truth because it's exposing who they are, all right, but let me go ahead and get some scriptures, okay, for showing that we don't need to be afraid, all right, this is in the book of Psalms, chapter 23 in the third verse all right <clears throat> i'm the fourth verse let me say this is yea i walk through the valley of the shadow of death i will fear no evil and who's the valley of the shadow of death all right that's america all right and where our brothers are spread out okay 
I will fear no evil for thou art with me. All right. The Lord is with us, man. All right. So we don't need to be afraid. Okay. Of anything. All right. How about Shemal Shai is in control. Thy rod and thy staff comfort me. These words. All right. The, the, and these words are the comforter that he sent. Okay. All right. So we don't, we need not to be afraid. Okay. All right. Especially <clears throat> when the Lord um, lifts up that standard. Okay. All right. He's going to give his men. All right. That's been laboring. That's been doing the things that's beneficial to the body. That's of the elect um, spiritual powers. All right. And I'm going to get that. All right. And then I'm going to close out. Thou hast, and this is Psalms 27 and 3. Thou hast, uh, thou hast should encamp against me, though in hosts, so like it, though in hosts should encamp against me. All right. People going against you. My heart shall not fear. Thou war should rise, though war should rise up against me. And this will I be confident. And what you're going to be confident in? That the Lord is going to protect you. That you're not going to be afraid, man. Okay. All right. Because the Lord is going to protect you. He is. He's, he's doing. He's, he's uplifting you through his word. He's giving you the belief and confidence that you need to have in him through his word. All right. Uh, roughly paraphrasing scripture. He never left anybody confounded of our forefathers. Okay. All right. Unless they were, you know, bad shit wicked, okay? All right. Um, let me go ahead and get this in Ezekiel. All So this is um this is Ezekiel twenty five and fourteen. All right. Uh and I will lay my vengeance upon Edom by the hand of my people. All right. <laughs> Ultimately those es Esau Edom is gonna is coming up against his truth, all right, with his propaganda, all right, his demonization tactics. But the Lord is gonna let the Lord's vengeance is going to be laid upon Edom by the hand of his people. That's you so-called Negro, Latinos, and Native American Indians, all right, of the elect. And they shall do an Edom according to my anger, according to my fury. They shall know my vision, saith the Lord. This is why we don't need to be afraid, all right? This is why we don't need to be afraid. And uh, and we're going we're gonna to have spiritual powers, okay, to do uh, the things that we need to do according to the lord's anger according to his fury all right because the lord is out of this world he doesn't need guns he doesn't need missiles he doesn't need bullets okay he doesn't need pestilence to kill a man he's not going to give us those things to kill a man he's going to give us those things to he's going to give us spiritual powers to do his anger and if his anger is to to wipe esau eat him out that's what we're going to do all right so we, we need not to be afraid. The Lord's going to be with us, all right? And the Lord is with us as as I speak these words. So with that, I want to say, Barakah the Yahweh, Barakah the Yahweh Shai, Barakah the Yahweh, Barakah the Yahweh Shai, Ka Halayim La, Yahweh Bashim El Shai, Bashim Harakak Radash. I want to give double honors to the apostles of Great Millstone, and I want to say, Shalom to all you brothers and sisters out there pushing this truth in all honesty and sincerity. Kwam Yasharala and Ababa Ball.